fucking shit. What is that? The, the Mick MC, but I don't know. It like a Willow lot of to MCs. somebody that is home. Good will. What is that? All right, where are we meeting? MC Plato. Good morning. All right, I'm on my way up there. Good morning, Captain Britain. <laughs> Captain Britain. We're about to have a really good fucking meeting. Yeah, okay. Doing okay? No, I'm not okay. I'm sick. <laughs> you need to. You probably should cut that shit out. <laughs> the day I don't get sick is probably more of the worrying standpoint. Anything we can do for you? Well, you have been no, traveling I, a lot, so. I have. I'm pretty sure it's just. Did you just move? Yes, I did. What do you want me to do? Wear a mask? Uh, mask so, you know, mask yes. back on. <laughs> That's fine. I'll put my mask back on, but you can't tell me shit if I go inside the clubhouse. You get okay. a free pass this time, so you don't get the rest of everyone else sick. <laughs> That's fair. <laughs> All right, I give you that. That was my screen. So, so after, after meeting first, and then we'll we'll convene with member. Yeah, from my uh, email I sent out to everyone earlier, appears that only uh, Miss Green here and Willow will be around. Okay. I like I like this light blue going on. Gideon, we're getting outnumbered. <laughs> getting? Yeah, that's how it's okay. I'm I was piss. on the first day that we were fucking. I remember that. I arrived. Everyone was wearing dark fucking blue. Okay. Yeah. Start wearing something different. <laughs> Who knows, maybe we'll be in leather at some point. Maybe. That's my bread and butter. Yeah. Never been a fan, but whatever. Well, we're gonna have to knock Lotus, or not Lotus, but fucking Lost down a peg or two. They're getting yep. really fucking arrogant. And I'll be Apparently. honest with you, I don't, I don't got no patience for none of that. At this point, I mean, who gives a shit about their fucking little club? You see them up here robbing houses, you break their fucking legs. Yep, and we'll start charging them if we use our fucking building. Yeah. They want to fucking play games? Well, good shit. <laughs> what did I miss? No, I oh. started the weird flex oh, yesterday. Lost being dickheads. Lost Legion and fucking... Disciples. Trying to do nah, a power I'm, not, I'm not gonna I'm not disciples gonna put were the good, disciples. Though. They were just there. Yeah, it was mainly lost and Legion trying to be cowboys, talking about how our cuts are fucking stupid because they're wrong. I knew it would become an issue at some point, just not in the first thirteen fucking days of being in state. I don't see why it's such a fucking big deal. Yeah, well, because it's anything. you don't put the MC in the rocker. It goes into its I own understand, story. but what's their fucking point? The convention it doesn't need a meet a meeting for that shit. Yeah. I didn't oh, even yeah. notice the difference till it was pointed out. It's all good. We'll have the last laugh in all of this. Any anything else other than them bitching about our top rocker apparently? Mm hmm They apparently don't see us as an equal. So. Yeah, apparently we need to learn what to do. That they were going to make a Legion branch out of here we could join. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh huh. I'll shit on Can that fucking list. Legion bet jacket. I don't give a care. If we wanted a Legion branch out of here, they can go and fuck themselves. No, oh, they wanted to take us over and make us Legion that so you can kiss my ass. Yeah. 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 I'll, I'll or put send two a in the delegate up here to teach us how to do MC life. I'll put two in the back of a Legion rocker before I fucking patch over. And yeah, that's basically the two options they gave you. They're like, you either do that or you can become one of us. But we choose option three. We can shove it all up their ass. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah we can yeah. do our own thing. We don't have to follow their rules. So what I'm hearing is I need to get a gun before I get a bike. Ah, uh, yeah, I recommend you get a gun. Uh, yeah. 
We'll ha we can help with that. That's not an issue if you don't have yeah. one. I think you're good gum right now. Oh. Apart from a Most license, expensive I need a ones less than a thousand. You know, there's a really nice cop, but I don't think she talked. What is up, Willow? Hi. I'm Hi. Deal. Is your hair whiter than you? No. It's always just goddess just locks. Willow. It glows in weird. the dark. Willow. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All the girls here just like blue. <clears throat> hey, these jackets aren't wearing? gender specific. <laughs> she wants no, to wear fucking denim, dark denim, lolly, wear dark denim. <laughs> if she wants to be correct, let her be correct. Oh, wow. At least I'm not fucking outnumbered this time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Actually, you men are on the fucking downslope here. That's true. This is good. This is good. Uh -huh. This means we're more special. Mm hmm. Yeah, Vicky. <laughs> Just like all the other MCs, they want us to be just like them. None of them are well, they special. had an they issue because Gunner be sent a fucking hang around for the Lost, a message about how we had females here in our group, and boy, the Lost got their fucking panties in a group and about that. Apparently, we got yeah, strippers very... and prostitutes or some shit. Fuck, you punch one of their hang arounds, man. They get really fucking uppity about it, too. They're like soft job little fucking wet bitches, I tell ya. Yeah. Wait, who's, who's a prostitute that I'm unaware of? It. Apparently, some uh, apparently we yeah. got girls, and so they called that you know soliciting. Oh, Dude, yeah. Huh? Yeah. Dumb yeah. Spot. yeah, I mean, it's what they think or something. <laughs> it's those pants. It's, it has the... You gotta can't take advice from a biker who fucking gets high all the time and wears flip flops everywhere. Oh yeah, run it. What about their pros? Was he prospect? Prospect going around just Cash. being a fucking goofball out of over himself, I riding the pink motorcycle. Other people's fucking yeah, yep. Cool. Yeah. They definitely, know, cuts, they definitely yeah. know how to pick him. Insulting other people's cuts and get his ass kicked for it. Pink trike. Yeah. And he said, "I was born fat." Oh, apparently you mm -hmm. promote too fast. What? What? Yeah, even though yeah. we're the only ones who fucking did it while we were here. That's the they, fucking kicker. They came into state with pre-prepared fucking. They what, came to the state. They officers out their from other chapters. Online. They put out online posts to get people in their positions, and then they want to get mad at us for meeting them in person. It's cute. It's very cute. It's actually true, though. It is true. It's a hundred fucking percent factual. Little fucking cunts. I was close to throwing punches. Yeah, so I didn't happy. even know what to fucking say, to be honest with you. I just stood there. So I was like, mm, thank you. That. Thanks for the feedback. <laughs> yeah, you were saying thanks. I was really hoping it was in your snide way. It was. Okay. I'm okay, so happy I was in that. Oh, yeah, you would have thrown punches 100%. I would have thrown punches. That would have been amazing. <laughs> and not to mention, out of every group that was there, we were the least ones. That's what sucked. Uh, yeah, we had like four so of us. Couldn't do nothing. It was like, like I was, I was still on a, I was still on a plane when you guys said that the meeting got changed. Yeah, like I good. couldn't. Otherwise, I would have been there. Because if it was today, like it was meant to be, I would have been there. But you're good. You're good. So where handled. the fuck is the sergeant and the secretary? They're on their way, probably. I bet you Gunner got in a fight. I haven't seen Gunner in days. I fuck. I don't want to go all the way down to the city. I, are we sure he's still alive? Reason. I don't know. <laughs> I'm hoping. You know what, though? I say, like, fuck them. They can have their little little groups and, you know, rules that you got to follow to be a real MC. But they can suck it. Like, we could be our own thing. We could be the pirates of the MCs. They probably, um, they probably already do. I'm just surprised Legion didn't show up in fucking shorts. No, but Death Row did in their fucking orange ass tank tops. Death Row didn't even know like how to fucking says. park their bikes. They had to be oh. told to back them in. If they're going to be so nitpicky at this point, if you ever see any of them driving a, you know, in a car in any way, shape, or form, <laughs> call them out on it. <laughs> and it's funny that they called us out on arriving in a fucking car because we got told about that shit after an incident went down and we scrambled to get there as quickly as fucking possible. So they can go fucking sit on their own goddamn dicks and spin. I don't give a shit. What, what about their permission to use their bikes that they gave us as of last night? 
Uh-huh. Cute, huh? All a bunch of little bitch, little bitch boys, a little bitch purpose. I don't want to be a part of their little play play group. I don't really care either, to be honest with you. And you know what? As far as I'm concerned, none of them are welcome in Polito Bay. At least not around me. Devil's Disciples, I'm happy with all of them. They're all pretty sound. But Legion yeah. and Lost and my, and my books can go fuck themselves. You know, if that's how you feel, I'll back you on that. <laughs> yeah, Legion brought the entire list. Mm hmm. The entire caliber wish list. And do you ever see them? That's the thing. Yeah, that's the yeah. They they never come up here. There, I never. Yeah, who see keeps them. dropping our houses? No idea, but we're gonna fucking find out. Yes, we are. Boy, they had concerns about us letting people rob. I say, as long as our yeah, guys sorry, are I didn't realize we were really gives a shit. Honestly. I didn't realize we were the fucking Polito Bay Police Department. Mm hmm. Yeah, someone to take that chance. Just don't wear the rockers. Don't wear the cuts if you're going to break into a house. Yeah. But I guess they want us tearing up their territory, so I guess that makes sense, right? <laughs> Go burn their shitholes into a ground. But whatever. Kill them with kindness. Yeah. Nah, fucking kill them with bullet. Just the tip? Nah, all the way. Uh, yeah. we'll, we won't go to war, but we'll be openly hostile. That sounds like fuck. Mara and Vic, I need to have a personal conversation with you both. Yep. Right back, y'all. Yep. Come on. We can just go back here. You hear me? Yep. Yeah. All right. I both I talked to both of you about doing a relationship with Willow, right? Yeah. yeah. I've decided to do a relationship with her. Just letting you know. I knew you wouldn't listen, so okay. Just don't <laughs> let it blow up into my face. I won't. So no worries. But I just wanted to be transparent with you. Don't let it blow up. Okay. Because you know what, what happens your... if it does. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What was your point of view on that, Mara? I told her that she's a fucking idiot and she shouldn't do hey, it. Hey, all right. <laughs> you know, for the fact that she's not going to listen to either one of us. I just told her that if she's going to do it, then don't let her blow back in my face. Yeah, Because she knows what happens if it fucks up. Oh, I'm shit at relationships Unless... anyway, so fuck it. It'll probably Unless fuck up anyway. And we'll get see... a nice big bowl of I told you so. Yeah, well, the last Lucky thing ball. I want to see is her get her fucking president patch ripped off of her because she fucked and broke one of the rules again. Okay. Mm hmm. I'll be safe. You have my word on that. And you guys can watch me too. Call me out. Well, I'm going to say one thing. You have no say now at this point in anything regarding her and promotions or anything like that. Oh, I know. Yeah. You so leave when... that to me or Mara. That's not an issue at all. And it won't be. <laughs> You haven't fucked it yet, right? Not Who's yet. Who's dating? Oh, okay. At least we haven't had that hurdle. That hurdle? Yeah. 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 Once you go past the fuck stage, it's it's all hurdles from that. When's the last time you fucked? Wait, were you like 13? <laughs> Five days ago, thank you very much. What was its name? <laughs> <laughs> no, but for real, it won't be an issue. Name? <laughs> oh, I don't remember. I blacked out. What happened? Fuck you. Now you're trying to fuck me? No. No, I don't mean any of This conversation's going a little above my pay grade. Oh, you trying to fuck her? Nope. Oh, okay. Are we done? Yep, yeah. I think we're good. Fucking kids. Yeah, you are older than me, aren't you? Uh-huh. I have no idea. Yeah. Same me. Uh, Harold, official. Gunner, you on comms by chance? 
Oh, fuck you, you're on radio. Yeah, I am. <laughs> All right, right on. Can you make your way up here when you get a moment? Yeah, we're starting our 30 miles an hour journey. Is Gunner with you? No. That's why we're going 30 miles an hour. Yes, please don't let anything bad happen to him. It's kind of an important night. Yeah, well... Yep, get some yeah. styrofoam. Yeah. Bubble wrap. Encasement concrete. No, because then he'd be dead. Yeah, no. I was going to say. Or that, that shit from Star Wars that they put, like, Han Solo in. Hmm. Nobody get that reference? Yes, I understand. Well, Han Solo okay. did what? Carbonite? Carbonite, yeah. that's Carbonite. the stuff. Yeah, go ahead and place him in Carbonite. I was thinking more of the Mandalorian in terms of that, but yeah. Ah, uh, you um, young pups. Yeah. What? I watched the whole no, Star No, no, she's right. The, I know the whole Star I've Wars watched too. all of them, and the Mandalorian was still better than all of them. The Mandalorian is very good. Mando. I uh, Mando was good. It was good, but it's not better than the fucking. Not actual. the original trilogy. Yeah. Mm -mm. Okay, well, it beats the Skywalker trilogy then. How about that? That's, but which one? <laughs> the the most recent one. That's the sequel. It's, only one it's, it's I still a Skywalker trilogy. The, the, the whole thing is a Skywalker story. The old one I can't stand is the this uh, weird right, creature. The secretary's down. It was really annoying. Oh, was God really damn happens. it, really? What happened? He crashed into a car. Uh, oh my God. He's oh, back no. up riding, but he's pissed as fuck. There's oh, blood. God. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh dear. Do you need us to come get I'm him? I'm just or? surprised that it didn't happen sooner. No, I, I, there's no way you can talk to him. He's super pissed. Good. I want his pissed off ass meeting. right fucking here because we got a lot of shit to cover. Yeah, I'm trying, smoke but I can't, I can't protect him from himself. I understand. Oh, uh, group Mara's sick, so if she takes her mask off, spray disinfectant in her face. That. I mean, like a little of spray bottle was uh, you like use for a can. I'm just there's gonna a, there's a the fucking mask on. <laughs> there's a can of Lysol on top of the toilet in the bathroom. Well, I'm just gonna that. keep the mask on. That. I'm just making sure we're prepared because I don't want to catch what you got. <laughs> um, it's I'm pretty sure you, you heard know, I, I could go anything, and, I could go but... and quickly install like a big bit of plastic on her side uh, of the table. Not gonna lie, I've been in uh eastern european uh eastern european eastern europe for the last fucking week so i could have caught something <laughs> you know what yeah i'm, I'm really you're considering you know that stuff there for banks i'm gonna put some of that up on your side of the table <laughs> plexiglass that's the stuff plexiglass. <laughs> how about we have this meeting but we have patched members in there but we'll wait to elicit their response on the subject matter until afterward that works for me is that that oh, way we're yeah, not having to cover shit multiple times. I don't want to cover the same shit twice. I bet you fucking don't. What? It's just ineffective. I mean, we I think we're more so Plus, an MC that is open to letting our members listen to our what we got going no, on. No, we're a caliber Mick. We're Mick caliber, goddamn it. Yeah. Mick caliber. <laughs> Plus, if like there's only two members, I have no issue with them just sitting. And if there was like fucking six of them, then I'd have an issue. Then they just stand in the corner and listen. Yeah, I'll we'll do that. That's what I think that's going to be way easier. Will do. If you guys have any crypto, sell it now because it sure is high. I don't got no crypto. Damn, twelve three. Fuck. Yeah. Could've waited. Yeah, that's fucking nuts. Don't you wish you had about 50k to throw in once it goes down? Yeah. I'll be taking donations for a better motorcycle if anybody wants to help me. Yeah, we're all gonna get busy with that, Vic. Just, you know. Yeah, I'm gonna yeah, just invest the rest my own money point. and whenever I get some good rewards back from the the crypto, I'll be dishing that out to y'all. We don't have a bank. That would be nice. Appreciate it. Do we have a 
place we could sell our motorcycle when the time comes? Nah, the government just takes it back off. They yeah. just take yeah. it. For I'm free. fucking pissed about that, actually. Because I spent $5,000 plus whatever I did to improve it. And then when I get the new bike, that motherfucker just disappears. Like, they just take did you, it from uh, you. Did you head down to City Hall and do a compensation for him? I should. I would. Because that leads Wait, me to can scratch you only my own motherfucking one vehicle? head. You, only one bike, apparently. Yeah, get that compensation. Uh, give me a I bike totally enough, expected so I get to be able too. to still have my other fucking motorcycle. And nope. Nope. Not on your phone app. No. Nope. Yeah, that sucker's gone. Yeah, they still. Yeah, definitely uh, head down to City Hall, get a compensation form filled out. Yeah. Extra 5k in your pocket. Yeah. It's fucking frustrating, to be honest with you. Not happy at all. That really upsets me. Well, I've uh, I regained the uh, the money I'd loaned off, so I'm back up to uh, 17k. Oh, holy shit, okay. Bike. Nice. How long does it take to get the Polito? That motherfucker put a gun, and I was about to fucking murder him. <laughs> yeah. Hello? Do you guys know how to use the recycling plant? I'm mm -hmm. new to collecting material. Yeah, it's, uh, you gotta wait till 9. Uh, for 12. 9 a.m. What? Yeah, the place doesn't open until 9 a.m. Oh, 9 a.m. Okay, sorry, yeah. I didn't hear you. Yeah, so just um, chill out by the door, and when it turns 9, they'll come and unlock. Oh, cool. You yeah, can $100 work overnight, too. Go shut up, Vic. <laughs> what? Hey. What did you say? I said $100 entry fee. I screwed around. Oh. <laughs> you can work overnight, though, just so you know. Like, they don't kick you out. Oh, cool. I didn't know. Yeah. Thanks. How are you guys yep. doing today? Doing good. good. What's your name? Uh, Gabe. You got a last name? Ryan. Gabe Ryan, okay. I'm Kelly yep. Caliber. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Riley Reaper. Nice to meet you as well. Yeah, I'm not introducing myself, but... <laughs> yeah, what is this fucking speed dating? <laughs> yeah, what the hell? <laughs> hey, uh, you, you might have a chance with her if you want to. Hi, my name's Gideon, and wow. I'm an alcoholic. You're an alcoholic? <laughs> Hi, Gideon. No, I'm not. Oh, okay. Aren't you? I'm Victor, I'm a smart ass. I thought you spelled dumbass wrong. Yes, I thought you did. Jesus. Y'all need Jesus. <laughs> nah, Jesus doesn't want me. I can believe that. You know. I really okay. need to come back when there's fucking officers around so I can get a fucking gun license. Mm -hmm. Oh? Oh, he's pissed. Oh, he's oh pissed. he is pissed. pissed. Oh shit. I'm just gonna move so you yeah, can park Yeah, let me get way. out of his way. Rumor has it his headlights aren't actually red, he's just that mad they're projecting red. MOVE oh, IT! Oh, the <laughs> Are they making boobs? Uh, yeah. One of the prospects has got to clean that shit up. Hopefully, your tire doesn't burn out from doing that. Did they make a dick? <laughs> it kind of looks like. <laughs> that is the. Is that a, that's a meteor, with a like a a, a fireball uh, behind it. A fireball. Dick. I don't know. Or it's like, it's a basketball, but it's like mid-air. Yeah, and it's I'm, gonna not, a bit of air I'm not behind seeing it. it. Yeah, okay. Yeah, no, I'm just You're trying too hard. Yeah. How look amazing are? today. So, you too. Yeah, that's you ready for a good actually. meeting? I hope you feel better. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Alright, glad you're here. Covid was still going on, and then you went. Well, I'm like very tired, so you just have to see how long I can be here. But I'll <laughs> you got it. Oh. Here was me thinking you just kind of killed over and died. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing kills me. What's up, Gunner? How you doing, Harold? Doing fine. How about you, Kebab? Doing good. Oh.
Are we going really back fucking to fucking pissed? But we need to have a conversation, and as opposed okay, to what I do two do separate time. fucking times, everyone's coming into it. Well, let's go do it. I'm gonna Waiting for door. someone. I think everyone's here. Everyone's At here. At least who's gonna be here? Mara has COVID, so stay away. Oh, fuck you. Where do you actually want me standing? Is it a big man to stand there? Or am I just going crazy? I don't think it really matters, does it? No, just get in here. I'm not worried about formalities. Okay, we don't need a... Uh, yeah, break. Rachel. What? Oh, against the. What'd you call me? Called you Rachel. Oh. Right. Oh, God sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, Wolf. <laughs> I just want to see if you. That's one way. To if you're awake, I take a fucking yeah. punch. We're good. Yeah. Let me put my shit. The back garage door is locked. We are Thank good. Thank you. Go. Everybody in here, here. No, not really. Smart asses. <laughs> I don't care if you want to come to the table. We're good. You too. All right, vice president's here. Treasurer is here. Secretary is here. Our sergeant at arms is here. And our road captain is here. President is all counted for, and two patched members are here. So we're going to start this out in a really fucking simple, contextual kind of fucking way. We got questioned by Legion and the Loss yesterday pertaining to qualities of RMC and how no one takes us fucking seriously as one. For one, we got our fucking patch knocked on because we had the MC and the upper rocker. I knew eventually it would come to be an issue. I didn't expect it in the first 12 fucking days of being in state, but whatever. Also, uh, Legion has put forth the communication on, since we don't know what we're doing as an MC, they'd be happy to create a charter for us up here in Polito Bay, to which they can fuck right off. They also offered to send a liaison up here to teach us the MC life. So we can be <laughs> like them. <laughs> I'm sorry. We were also sorry, told Chris. that we are um, not demonstrating the proper MC lifestyle because we arrived in a car with our cuts on uh, to that president's meeting that was spontaneously thrown at us after an incident here where two of our people got shot. So we were made to look like fucking dipshits to that point as well. Um, what else was there, Vic? Oh, um, apparently we promoted our people too fast, even though we didn't, you know, incorporate the internet to find our people. We actually met people in person. Apparently that's a problem. Mm-hmm. Uh, what else? I'm blanking now that you put me oh, on the spot. Oh, we're robbing people, apparently. That got brought up yet again. And soliciting prostitutes. Uh huh, Gunner. <laughs> Wait, I'm a prostitute. Apparently, you got all the girls on your belt. Oh yeah, well, I'm worst looking prostitute I've ever seen. <laughs> I'm one hot motherfucker. Mm -hmm. Pay for that shit. <laughs> okay. Anyway, are you? I mean, uh, I'm sorry. I'm uh, I'm sorry, Chris. But are you fucking kidding me? I really wish I was. I really do. So Who the, the fuck do they think they are? Well, they're they're the they're the real deal. They're the fucking five for five after five fifty five meal deal, bitch. They're the fucking bees knees. They're the badasses. Yeah. They're the fucking oh, MCs. Clearly. The fucking MCs right there. They're the culture. Apparently, they know how it's done, and we just don't do it right. So we have to follow it the right way. If we don't follow the manual properly, oh, we, we're just not a real MC. Okay. So and this. Uh, yeah, this yeah, is continue. my proposal to everyone here. I will only ask the officers to discuss this, and then I will open it up for the patched members to communicate their their beliefs, comments, questions, concerns, whatever it may be. Is everybody okay with that? 
I. Yep. God. I want us to rebrand. I don't want us to be Caliber MC. I want us to create something unique to ourselves, whatever the fuck it might be, that's strong, that's organized. And I need your help to try to determine what that path might look like. With this, we'll be switching the leather. We'll be switching our patch. Our cuts will be different. Our organization will be, we'll still have the same member base. Everything like that. The ranking structure of this new rebrand might be different. I will gladly step down to support whatever method that we need to take to make this successful. But I need your guys' fucking input on what we do. And if that's something we're going to do, how the fuck we get it done. Okay. And I will open it up. Anybody who wants to go. Okay, so... Counter question. Why are you rebranding? Because it's my last name that we're currently using. And Fair enough. it's very specific to just me. Um, and it doesn't really signify... The presence of all. You know what I mean? Get you. I would like to go... I, and I'll just throw this out there. I think you should reinvent the Vikings. I really Let do. Let me just put this out there that we need to fucking clarify if we're doing this because we wanted to or because they're pushing us to it because I refuse to be a fucking pushover. This isn't from us being pushed. This is us rebranding to build unification and strength. Because we want it. In a way to tell them to fuck off. Well, that's up for us to decide, right? That's why we're here. Okay, okay. Yeah, I hear you, Prince. Okay, well. I mean, I've been a Viking most of my life. I haven't been a caliber for that long. You know. So, you, are you trying to say that you want to open a Viking chapter in Belito? I mean, Grape said it's shut down. That's why we both were in the can, so. There's never been That's a Viking chapter. Or we just, or we put our heads together and we formulate another name and we make it what ours. About, I've had an idea that was circling in my head recently. What? Yeah, you know, you have your naval history, and. I believe the new guy did too, but just the idea of, and I thought of this as like steal and plunder, do what we want because we don't have no rules of like, you know, the pirates, but along the eyes of like Jolly Roger or something along that line. Like Buccaneers? I hate Buccaneers, but <laughs> like yeah. Like, are we going fucking NFL now? <laughs> oh God, blah. Uh, no. Go ahead, Mara. Um, in the nicest sense, if we're going to rebrand... I recommend rebranding to a name that hasn't been that doesn't have any association with any other group that we've done before. That's right. Make it a fresh start. There. Make something. it something new. Uh, if you want it uniformed, then uh, there's a couple of names that I can think of off the top of my head just for the fuck of it. Go ahead. But, uh, okay. Um, um, <laughs> Just because they like to say that we're we're not like everyone else, the outsiders. Okay. You like the lost? <laughs> it's a little bit. Can we just call ourselves uh, the found? Uh, frozen outlaws. That's good. Uh, uh what well, on the border of the entire fucking map? So border hounds. Okay. Uh, black hearts, white eagles. Uh, fuck, I don't know. Um, um, we could be edgy like Black Lotus and be Black Diamonds. Okay. No, I don't like that. You know, we're not <laughs> representing ourselves off of Black Lotus. No, I'm, no, I'm, throwing, names, I'm throwing names up. Like, I'm just trying to spark up other people's ideas because instead of going with something that's already been done, we might as well what just about? try something. What about something like with my idea with the pirate idea, something along the lines of Marauder or Raider? Okay. See, I had the name of doing Heathens. I think that'd be neat because we all are. <laughs> but 
Um, Vikings is something that I'm familiar with too. Just like these two fucking foreign bitches over here. No offense. Um, but if we want bitch. to make it, yeah. But if we want to make it our Thank own, you. then I think we need to fucking do that. And I think that's kind of a big deal. And that's something that is ceremonial. It's um, it's a beautiful thing to be able to stand together with a commonality that was forged from the people that are currently, you know, occupying its space. Shit like that is very quintessential. It's very important and it's very powerful. And this is a very unique moment for everybody in this room. Something. Let me just be absolutely fucking clear about one thing. If you decide to become the Vikings, that's not just a fucking name change. That's adapting this entire group to a whole new lifestyle that not every, everyone may like. It's mm -hmm. not just a fucking name change. It's everything that comes with it. And you're you're all not going to like it. It's not for everyone. It's a whole lot different than, than what Caliber is. Yes, it is. So are we just going to throw out random fucking names or are we going to have something that means something to us? We need to have something that means something to us. It unifies yeah. us. It has to stand for how we feel. Mm -hmm. And right now, I am very fucking annoyed. And I want to push fucking back. And I want to get motherfuckers to understand very simply that we are fucking here and that we are for fucking real. Okay. Press question. Go. Why did you have a meeting with Legion and Lost... That's not oh, the full council. That's not even half the council. Devils was there as well. So I'm glad you asked. Um, for context on what the purpose of last night's conversation was supposed to be about was for Black Lotus and how they are going to be basically told tomorrow on Saturday that Victor Vasquez is to step down as the club's president and Mac Richter is no longer going to be their sergeant at arms. And he may go go down to a patched member, or otherwise he may face being put in the fucking ground himself. Everyone's whoa, whoa, sick whoa, and whoa, tired geez. of it. Okay, okay, and why is that? Since because when, they've been first of snitching all, to since... people and doing a whole bunch of stupid shit. Okay, okay. First of all, the councils, it's none of their business who is on which title within a club. It's none of their business. Mm -hmm. First of all. Secondly, so they're actually siding on the Vago side in this whole shit show? Oh, yeah. Well, then they can fuck off. I think they're actually siding with the group that haven't been snitching to law enforcement the entire time. Haven't and what do you know about the whole snitching? The Vagos is talking about it. Yeah, they're the talking. Fucking... They're talking a lot of shit. Vagos shot me twice. They threatened Willow. Mm -hmm. Are we going to believe them over one of the bikers? Yeah. Really? Nice, nice I mean, I've seven. spent a shit ton of time with the, with, the, with the Lotus guys. And what I've seen from them, they don't seem like snitches. Yes, he reported to the police. It was a fucking legal business. He wouldn't even get out his insurance money if he wouldn't report it to the police. What do you expect him to do? They, Rata, went into his own shop in the middle of the fucking day full of customers, starting to rob the place. Based on what? Because a baller came in and ordered a tattoo. It's fucking ridiculous. And this whole shit show wouldn't have happened if those pussies on Vagos would have fucking put a bullet in his head! Agreed. And that we even consider listening to those yellow motherfuckers. It's an outrage, and I'm embarrassed. And if anyone has any other objection against this, please let me know. Because I've fucking had it with the yellows. They're nothing but trouble, and the leadership is a fucking 
outrage because they can't keep one fucking member under control. If we would have this same situation, let's call it, and I'm not calling up, let's, let's say, okay, if Reaper would go gone rogue, went into a fucking barbershop run by the Vagos, started robbing people, then just because she noticed, well, there was a last member who went in there and got a fucking haircut and started a fucking war. Would we just silently sit there and do nothing against her? Wouldn't we maybe tell her, you know, Riley, you fucked up big time. And if you do that again, there will be harsh fucking consequences. But no! They just I continue! Would've, I would have beat her fucking ass down to the deck. Exactly. That's my fucking point. But not everybody And anyone operates. who sides on those fuckers is either insane or really fucking stupid. Look, this just is my, because this is my they perspective, did. Gunner. Okay? Is that we are... All of this is new. This is big problems in a real quick way. Now, I understand the Vagos are the biggest culprits in all of this. I get that. But right now, I am sick of this fucking council feeling that they can, you know, decide upon other groups what is and what is not satisfactory behavior. Yeah. They don't okay, have any but... pull there. Fine. Well, let me go. Let's go the other way then. If they decide to pull out, kick out the Lotus with that bullshit, because that basically black men, you know that they will never accept. I wouldn't accept it. If someone, if someone from the council says, "Hey, K-pop needs to step down, and we're 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 gonna make Harold a patch member," I would just f not even politely. I would just tell them to fuck off. Mm -hmm. I back them all the way. No one fucking questions that. Same go for the... Then I would say, let's turn the table around. Okay. Tell them to go fuck themselves and their grandmother. And we side with the Lotus. I'm no issue with that. The only issue that that's going to cause is that everyone's going to disassociate us like they have them. So they're already done that. Apparently, True. I'm running prostitutes, uh, what was it else? Uh, we apparently have a weird name. We're not a serious motorcycle club. And what all kinds of bullshit I've just heard. So we're already there. I mean, that train has already gone. Left the station. Shush. Gone. <coughs> you bring up valid points. You do. The counts. The whole, the whole point is, you know, I've already heard, you know, the talk in the town about Legion and Devil Disciples and all that, you know. You know, Devil Disciples tried to be all tough and cool and say, well, no women allowed. They changed. Apparently, <laughs> they were they were saying, oh, well, we're hardcore. We're doing the old style. That, that held up long. or took it a week until mm -hmm. they changed. But they're apparently still hardcore super superheroes. I don't know. Lost. How often do you see them around? There's a lot of them. They have a Last they have a good their... sized fucking membership. Yeah, and that shit. Last night with their but... disrespectful ass fucking prospect. Uh huh. No yeah. fucking control of their people. Again, and that's what I'm telling you. And they trying to teach us how to roll shit. I can say, okay, let's let's be a little bit, you know, self critical against I um, mean, what we're running. Okay, yeah, I think to be honest, we've been a little bit too loose. You know, you know, in terms of maybe discipline, sure. That can be no. We, we can we can work on that, but the rest of that bullshit. Fine, I I totally and you know, I agree with your standpoint. Okay, maybe your name shouldn't be on the back. Not you know because I don't like it, but it is very much associated to you personally. Yeah. And that you know, I I, I see want that, something that's that, associated to us. Yeah, I get that. But I do not at all agree with their standpoint, and especially against the Black Lotus. That is fucking bullshit. So do we back the Lotus, then? <laughs> My vote is yes. Let's not take a vote just now. Well, she asked, and I just answered. 
like honestly at the end of the day this is one thing i'm pissed i'm that's making me upset and it, like where i stand on it is 100 percent. like i don't give a fuck about the council they think they got it right but nobody's got it fucking right like when they complain about vehicles a car well fuck a car but a truck could be very handy sometimes in certain situations if i limit wait, yourself wait, to wait, fucking wait, two wait, wheels okay wolf fill me so they say we're not allowed to drive cars basically apparently cages as they call it. okay mm -hmm. interesting last just drove in a fucking smurf van well, on yeah, didn't 68. they have fucking slam vans back in the day <laughs> well and they let's use a rusty not, fucking let's not so focus on that that's fucking bullshit we don't agree I'm with just that make, making we points don't. like i i could use okay. a vehicle sometimes in a certain well, the thing is, is that would make us a lot that. more efficient okay. than a fucking motor being a part of this council seems to give them the authorization to depict what the fuck is acceptable okay. where i don't that. really feel that anyone else outside of rmc dictates what the fuck we do and what the fuck we represent here Agreed. And I'll put my foot down their fucking throats if they want to push the issue. Okay. Considering we have a shit ton of issues, this is... Uh, may I suggest, Press, could we do this, you know... Could we break this down and, you know, do one thing at a time, put it to vote, and then move to the next, because this is going to be complicated. I would suggest first... Yes. Okay. Could we maybe first get a vote on, okay, are we rebranding yay or nay? All right, officers' votes up first. I'll call, I'll call your name. You give me your fucking vote. All votes would be tallied. Majority will mean pass. On the status of us rebranding RMC to a name of our choosing to make it synonymous with who the fuck we are, Pres or Vice President, how do you vote? Yay. Treasurer, how do you vote? What was that? Hey. Yeah. Secretary, how do you vote? Hey. Sergeant, how do you vote? Yay. Road Captain, how do you vote? Yay. Patched Member Riley, how do you vote? Yay. Patched Member Willow, how do you vote? Yay. President votes yay. Motion is passed. Make sure to mark that in the ledger, okay? Yep. Now, I really think it's important that we kind of solidify what the fuck we just voted on so we have a direction. I'm going to handle that tweet. Somebody looking for us or something? Looking to sell yep. material. God damn. Just, just tell them to piss off. For Might as well. I mean, if they want to sell it, just get one of the patch, can get out and fix it. Just, we, just because we have a meeting, we, we shouldn't stop business. I want to also put this up for vote with the group that is currently here. Since we have our full officer collection. Um, when it comes to dues. Club dues. That needs to be a thing. I don't necessarily feel that that needs to be a thing until people get situated into their motorcycles. Oh, sorry. I'm glad you I'm almost missed. took out Little Reaper. <laughs> sorry, Little Reaper. <laughs> And she Awkward. links. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> just, just checking your reflexes. Now, do you all, and this is just an, a vote for officer. Now I need to know what your stance is on that. Because we are a club, it should have dues. But I don't think that we should be collecting dues until everyone has their motorcycle. Yay or nay? All in favor, say yay. Yay. Yeah. Yeah. Mara? Yeah. Okay. All opposed to that, say nay. Please mark that one down as well, Secretary. Um, And then we will get together and discuss what dues will look like in the future. But that is a while down the road. 
Another method of business here that I want to discuss is giving assistance, financial assistance, to those who have yet to get their motorcycles. That is something that needs to happen. I agree. Everybody agree? Uh, are we talking mo final motorcycles or rusty ship? Final motorcycles. Bikes, thank you. Everybody in agreement with that? Yeah. Yeah. Gunner? I always did you. Okay. Reaper? Yep. Willow? Yeah. That measure is passed as well. Please log that as well, please. I'll say yay. Oh, I thought you did. I thought I heard you, Sergeant. Fuck, speak up. <laughs> Can't talk through your mustache? It's a bullshit filter on. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. So what do we call ourselves? What makes us who we fucking are? What identifies us? Outlaws. That's what the 1% is. Yeah. That, that, that's what we are, so we need to work on some name like something to do with that. We don't follow their fucking rules. No one controls piggybacking off of that, that's why I think we should uh, rebrand back into the Vikings. Vikings were known to be vicious and controllable. Yeah. I mean, no. I, mean, I agree. I agree with uh, Gideon's point, but Gunner. Gideon, you also have to be aware Gunner. that... Yeah. Are you aware of that? what that would mean for this club? Yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. That's what I said. Oh. Mm. I agree on your point, Gideon. Have. But it's also a... Ch there is a change of lifestyle. It. Vikings MC. We're not, you know. It's rough. We don't think shit, and everyone is quite aware of it. Do you mind if I take this one? Yeah, please do. Got it. So Vikings work a lot differently than what you're used to. It's a brotherhood that operates with. Uh, let's just say, a more serious attitude and toughness attached to it. Like Gideon pointed out, we don't take shit. What we are is defined by how others see us, and, you know, that dates back to, to the times of the early Vikings. So, uh, when the enemy saw the dragon ships approaching on the horizon, they didn't know what was coming. They were fully unprepared, for uh, the ferocity of the Viking warriors, armed with nothing but axes and shields. They had no fear in their eyes. These stories derive from ancient legends, and they are strictly adhered to by members of the Vikings MC Club. The fear that enemies felt is the same fear that we strive to inflict on others. Simply by them hearing our motorcycles roaring through the city. The Viking patch symbols, let's just say the text is very visible. It's a large piece of the of the patch. Because you're supposed to read that. That's the last thing you read when we ride away. The Vikings are not followers. They're natural leaders and should be met with high respect and regarded as pioneers, or else the Vikings have failed. If you become a Viking, you must embrace the pagan lifestyle and all that comes with it. They're ruthless people. They're not as family oriented as you're used to with caliber. Take that into serious fucking account, moving forward on deciding whether to become the Vikings or not. Thank you for that, Sarge. So I'd like to hear from our patched members over there, Willow and Riley. Um, well, I kind of liked what I was hearing from Victor about uh, something with outlaws. Because that's what we represent is the 1%. And uh, outlaws or something like that. Uh, I was liking the sound of that. 
Very good. Rilla? Um, I actually agree to that. I kind of like that we are a family aspect of things. Um, I understand hiking is as a long tradition, but I also want to kind of stick with a lot of the things that we have here because I feel like there's a lot of good things going on. So I'll, I'll actually cling myself to Riley and what Victor was saying. And this is why it's important for us to make it our own, right? But still have that tenacity, that fierceness amongst who we are as people that commands that respect with the Sarge had stated. So where do we draw that line? And what do we call it? Can you I know elaborate? Everybody's... Well, I mean, Vikings are set in stone. That is how they no. are. That is that is who they are. I'm against the Viking name now just because of who I we am are. against it. Okay. I am very hot against it. May, may, like I just, may I just interject in one thing? Okay. Treasure, could you please remove your mask? Policy one. She's sick. She's sick. Okay, gotcha. Okay. I, yeah, My apologies. Was... Yeah. Uh, um, no. Uh, I'm hot against it. I have been since the beginning of this meeting. It's, it's, it, I understand. And no offense to the two people who have been Vikings. Uh, I just, if we're going to rebrand, I don't want us to rebrand into something that's already been. And I've said this on the standpoint multiple times. No, it doesn't make what sense. What about, well, we've had the talk of like outlaws, but someone, what did someone say earlier? Something about um, being like not part of them or uh, on our uh, own, The like outsiders. Rules. Outsiders. What about like outcast? Sounds weak. It does. And lonely. Once I said it in words. Mm -hmm. Rebranding to Outcast suggests we've you know, taken into heart what they said yesterday. Yeah, exactly. I agree. I, I was just throwing names off. out. No, you're good. There's a lot of people with a lot of gears spinning upstairs. You think... May I... May I give an input? Yes. I think. I think we should adjourn this point so everyone can deliberate. I mean, this is not a lighthearted discussion to be had. No, and it's not it's, something It's our that... soul. Exactly. So I, yeah, so I would say we adjourn this uh, this specific point for the moment, come back with, let's say, a couple of suggestions and then put it to the vote. Because again, it's it's we shouldn't, you know, just try to quickly yep. no, brainstorm out a name. It's it's literally, you know, the embodiment of what you do. Yeah, it's a very good point. All right, so let's uh let's adjourn. Go have a smoke. Well, I Whatever. don't think we're finished yet. What else would you like to discuss? The other stuff with uh, what happened yesterday. I, I would I would like to I would like to get put on the table whether we tell the council to fuck off and we side on with the lotus or if we're just gonna follow the fucking leash pardon my french i say we adjourn with that as well to give us time to think this clearly with you know emotions not running as high as they are oh believe you my emotions will be running high all day long about this i think i will go out and put my fucking two cents into that very question i think we should just say fuck the council and we should be our own we should be our own entity Oh, yeah, K-pop. Have you talked to Vasquez? No. Okay, so uh, do they even know what's coming? I have no idea. I think we need to reach out to them because I f I find this fucking this is this is. I mean, I'm. Well, Logan I'm McKean I'm not or whatever the... from from the Legion wants to cut the heart out of Victor. Who? Yeah, Logan, the president of Legion Motorcycle Club. And, and why does he want that? Is because he married to Vagos or what? <laughs> Probably. They have a very good relationship. I'll never see. 
This Apparently, is a big decision now, because if we decide that we're backing Black Lotus in their ultimate time of need, it's going to make us look exactly how everybody thinks that they that we are. So if that's a discussion or a decision that we move forward with, understand the dilemma that comes with it. I don't like... I mean, okay, they're not a part of our family. But they're bikers. And they've shown me great respect. I think they've shown most of you great respect. Absolutely, so yeah. It's possible to meet them. I have no reason to doubt them. I had a talk. I've had several talks with both Vasquez and with Richter. Look, we're the only I mean, ones who I showed up the no day that reason. all that shit happened. We're the only fucking MC that showed up and tried to make shit work and to make sure they were good. And then we went and we did a ride with them, a run, to celebrate the loss of their friend and his life. So, yes, I think our relationship is strong. But if we continue to, you know, move down the fucking path of this council and those egocentric fucking men who lead it, then we're only going to be putting ourselves in a dire situation because the lost can't be trust. They don't want to share fucking things that they're crafting. They don't want to do any of that shit unless it specifically entertains them and what they get out of it. And my vote is to say fuck the council. Well, since the treasurer called the vote. Victor, how do you... Uh... Uh, fuck him. Okay, Gunner. Do you really have to ask? Yes. <laughs> they can fuck themselves and their mothers. Sergeant. feel that this was a rushed vote. Would you like to delay the vote? No. I'll go with what you're going, so, yay. Captain? To you as well for me. Reaper? Yay. Willow? Yay. Did I call you, Mara? I was on the side. Okay, then you were in favor. Uh, mm -hmm. Then I stand in favor as well, and it passes unanimously. Fuck the council. So I'll bring up the secondary option on the vote. Was what we do, and we'll deliberate before we vote on this. But how? What are we doing with Lotus? Suggestion. Allies? Allies, or we just part ways and we be copacetic? May I have a suggestion? Yes. Sit down with them. Put the cards on the table. And depending on how it plays, take a decision from there. Works for me. All in favor of that motion, say aye. 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 Hi. Hi. Okay. All in favor of not following that motion, say nay. All right. Eyes have it. I like that, Gunner. That's good thinking. And we'll do that. Fuck the council Thank and you. sit down with Lotus. Should we not be able to get a hold of Lotus between now and tomorrow evening? Are we going to continue with the council as normal until we can have said sit down? We will not be at the council tomorrow, and we will instruct Lotus not to do the same. To do the same. Who's taking the lead? Nobody. Level? If I'm around, I'll do it. Good. Can That's you reach out to me if you don't get? Of course. Was there any other topics that need to be brought up? Or should we adjourn for a little? 
conversate him. I, I need to fucking smoke after this, Jesus. I think for the future, when we put important things up for a vote, we need to weigh all the pros and the, the pros and the cons and put them on the fucking table and not just vote in fucking blindness. Which is my and opinion. what do you feel has been voted in, in fucking blindness? Mostly everything except fuck the council. But you didn't put none, no one here who made a vote put any of the pros or the cons on the table. Like what could happen if we side with the, with the Lotus? What happens if we don't? That's why we haven't voted on it. We voted on sit down, not yeah, whether we're siding with saying. it. That's what I'm saying for the future. Not it. You're all dismissed. We'll reconvene shortly. Oh, what a shit show. What's that? Rest. I need a word. You have my attention. Do we need to leave? Yes, please. All right. Well, you're fine. You're the vice president. You good? I have equally as much respect for both of you. Let me just move on. Appreciate it. I can hear you. I think coming up with the name, I know that we're going to think about it, but it, it shouldn't be this way that we, we go home to ourselves and we think about what name we want, because that's not us. We need to think about what we are. Everyone here more or less made it clear what, we, what they think we are, that we're not pushovers. You're right. I'm going to. I just think as well when you opened the meeting, press with all due respect, you said that you're willing to step down, and I think that is doesn't strengthen. Do you know what the context was the to which I said that? I know, but I'm not sure that everyone gets it. I'm going to push for, and I want your support with that. That we're going with the Vikings anyway. That we make it our own thing. Like a new Viking? Yes. Because Vikings has history. It's not a... No one can come to us and say, Hey, you're new at this. It's like saying we're going to go and be... Hells Angels, for instance. Mm -hmm. It's a known name. And there's currently no active chapter in San Andreas. Correct. Well, I'll be honest uh, with you. That's the first thing yeah. I thought about. Earlier this morning when I was spinning all this shit through my fucking head. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to put that forward as her final suggestion. But there's Then we have to convince Mara. Yep. She's and anyone else. The obstacle. Because if you lay it out there that this is going to be a new version of the Vikings... But they we're still going to represent the same thing. We're not going to be pushovers. We do our own thing and people need to fucking respect us. If we want to handle a club business in a certain way, people are just going to have to fucking accept it. If other clubs have a problem with it, deal with it. Suck it up. I like that. That's what I've been looking for. Mm -hmm. And to me, Vikings represent that. No one fucking touched us when we were Vikings. And not to mention the fucking patch is fucking gorgeous. Yeah, thank you. I designed it myself mm -hmm. when I was young. <laughs> you remember that far back? I I, I don't. Yeah. Hardly. <laughs> I never got to be a Viking. I was always, I joined Caliber right after some of the stuff went down. I rode with them but a little yeah, bit. There's going to be, you're going to have to talk. We're going to have to talk a lot with, obviously, with Gunner because he he's the longest standing member of Vikings. We joined at the same time, but I've been away longer than he has. Well, we brought that fucking patch from Stockholm over here to San Andreas. Set up a chapter in Grapeseed. It was, it was, it was, it was amazing. And I'm going to push for that because I think, I feel that that's us. What we're doing right now, fucking the council, basically, is, is what Vikings would have done.
mm-hmm. go our own way. We do our own thing and we're fucking proud of it. Yeah. Watch That's us in your fucking be. better watch out motherfuckers. Shit's about to get yeah. real. Well, that's that's what I wanted to bring up with you. Because I'm glad if you I'm did. if I'm going forward with this, I need your support. I know we have Gunner support. Gideon, we yeah. can get him on board as well. Mm-hmm. But you need Willow, or do you? I mean, Willow and and Willow and Riley, Riley can. They technically in office. It's kind of a with their rank. It's more so as a. Sure. For being Mara. supportive courtesy. thing is not courtesy. Yeah, that's the word. Not really necessarily required. Mara is the big one because she's gonna be the one to have the biggest fit. But at the end of the day, does it have to be unanimous? Yeah. I think a unified. So cons- I, I think unification unified, is is very important when it comes to sending a message to the rest of the MC. That is true. Solidarity sure. is How a big fucking deal. Before we push this forward. Well, I, good things I shouldn't think be rushed. I think we can talk it out after the thing, though. Mm-hmm. I do after believe that we break, could. we can talk about it. Because if we sit down with Black Lotus, we need to be transparent. We've voted mm-hmm. this through. It's going to happen. The name change. The be new ready. Patch. not being told what to do by a fucking group of people. Exactly. And then they're going to ask, so what are you going to be? And it's, 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 it's good to have an answer to that. It's just my two cents. Now you listen to me, Harold. Yes. If we do decide that we're going to go Vikings, you and Gunner will be leading it. I will step down. And that was the premise between what I was speaking about before. I don't see that happening. Press. It needs to. If you can get Gunner back as a president, I will support that. But I'm still, you're still my top vote. Either of you two. I have mad respect for both of you. You've done a great job with this, with this club. I'm fucking proud to be a member of it. So am I. Same. Under your leadership. Same. Well, let's go have a cigarette then. Shall we? Let's do. Thank you. Press. Press. You want me to pull Gideon aside? I mm-hmm. talk to him. Go for it. He's in the room back there. Crafting room. Can you give me a cigarette? I haven't smoked in forever, but I need one. Sorry. Thanks. Mm-hmm. How you done? All right. No worries. Stress again. So hard now. Yeah. Hmm. What did you say? Hmm? Sorry, I said, what did you say? I said, so hard now. Okay. Yeah. Try that again. Yeah. Yeah, it's a hard no. Unwaveringly. Even if we formed it to be our own thing? Not with their uh, dogmatic approach. You won't. What if we're you... still on top? Mm. It's gonna cause conflict. Uh, 
won't let it. Yeah, well, it'll cause it'll cause tremors. In what way? Or they'll leave. It'll be one of the two. You can't take their name and create a chapter and not expect anything if you take their name. What would I be expecting? They'll probably try and expect you to, to step down. I'd gladly step down for it. That's how important it is. You know I, I know rode with line. them, right? I know. I'm just... I'm on a hard line. It's gonna take a lot to try and convince me off of Okay. But, but if you guys vote it in, then you guys vote it in. But my vote's always gonna be nay on it. Well, kind of difficult to vote it in when you vote nay. I'm sorry. I will tell you, though, if you're going to vote nay, then your fucking ass better be here to help pull some of the weight. Okay. Do you really want it? Mm-hmm. It's the one yeah, thing that's been clicking in my head since I fucking put this thought together earlier. You really want Vikings. I do. Stands for what we want. And if it's in our own way. It's not going to be in your own way. That's where it's going to be from the get-go. We've already got support from one of them. But we... My only thing that I'm going to put out there, if this does become a reality, is that we define exactly what it is and the characteristics around it to make it to what people actually want and not some strict, you know, what you make fucking. Well, I'm going to be outvoted on this, so fuck it. Fine. <laughs> that was well, I have you. I have uh, Vic, fucking Gideon, those two. I'm the only person that's even remotely thinking no, so there's no point in arguing it. I thought of all I got, I just, nothing sounds right. Yeah, when I, when I woke up and I stirred all fucking night after yesterday, and I sat here for fucking hours spinning shit in my head, and the only thing that kept fucking coming back and circling around was moving to that. Pretty sure we'll lose the one. Oh, okay. <laughs> but this is a name that comes from a long history of respect. And like I said, I rode with them in a different location for a while. And it was it was pretty fucking awesome. It, but it was strong. But there was respect, you know? And I really don't want to do Caliber anymore. Because it's not. It's centric to just me. And it's not centric to everything else. I didn't else. have an issue with changing the name. I know. It's 
It's a big fucking deal. Alright, I'll let you talk. Alright, what are we gonna talk about? How you doing? I don't know. What's going on? It, nothing. I was just... I didn't feel like, you know, socializing with somebody. What happened? This is... All of this shit just makes me think. Talk to me. Vagos are definitely some interesting people. And Racha Ramirez is definitely a person that fucks with everybody and everything. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, I'm also thinking that, that like, it's not our war. It's definitely not our war. War, no. It won't be our war. And I totally respect that. And to be fairly honest, I really didn't want to support, like, Vagos and whatever. There have been nothing but respectful against us. At the same time, it's still... I hear a cop. I hear a cop. I just heard a cop. Yeah, I heard it too. Cop? Interesting. Oh, no, that was two doors. Yeah, everything with us and the Vagos, I mean, we got clear lines of communication, shit like that. Yeah, and with, with like Black Lotus and everything, there have been nothing but respectful against us. But, mm -hmm. but I totally support like rebranding and getting a name of our own and all that stuff. But. All the shit that is going on is pretty much just a war between Black Lotus and Vago. Yeah. They've done a lot of stupid shit, Black Lotus has. And I found out the other day, they went and had a conversation with Grove Street families and Victor pulled a gun. So, really? Yeah. I mean, from what I can see, Victor seems like a loose cannon himself. A little bit. See, the thing is, like, with MCs, they operate on a structure, right? On a ranking structure where everyone's opinion matters. Your family. Um, officers' opinions dictate exactly what happens with the MC. Victor operates on he is the one who calls the fucking shots, and his word is what is done. Which is not necessarily how the MC, sh MC should operate. And that makes them a little bit of a difference in MC culture than even us. And especially the other groups, you know? And I totally respect that, and I totally understand that. 
that, but like when Harold was talking about like, you know, rebranding and he was talking about you know, the Vikings and all, it's just I'm actually very happy. I reckon you Mara. I haven't met you on Willow, by the way. Hi. Hi. I have a lot about it. Oh, I hope it's only good things. <laughs> Is it good I reckon thing? it is. If this is this little snow princess that has told you about, oh yeah. god, snow snow princess, snow yeah. princess. Hey, Reaper. Snow princess. That's a new you one. Just ignore cool. that. You got the white oh, hair. Yeah, I know, but yeah, whatever. Um, oh. cyborg to keep up. Just... One moment. All I care about is like that we find a thing that works for us. I don't want us to go into a brand that has already, you know, been established. And to be fairly honest, what Harold was telling me kind of scared me. Like, I like huh? Okay. I said I like it. You like it that it scares me? Thank you. No, I like you that you actually have a different opinion other than the rest of them. <laughs> well, I mean, I get that it is the brain that, that's like well established and all that stuff, but I'm more like creating a thing for us, a name that we can stand for, a name that we build up. And I definitely feel like if we all can be a part of building up in, like a club, it will definitely be beneficial for us. And Gunner, I've been in a fucking standoff with him. And Harold is just staring at me every single time he sees me. He's like, he's giving me the death stare. Like, mean, can you just imagine me being part of Vikings? I'll probably go down to Prospect again. You do understand, though, that if we do rebrand to the Vikings and we go by the Viking shark, you two cannot date. Yeah, right? You understand. Because that's going to be something that they're going to be very, very, very strict on. I do understand that. And that was more the caliber than you are. Because me and Vic are fine with you two dating. But you know that if we rebrand to something that's already been established and that has that reputation, you two cannot date. Well, we'll see. And that'll be to, to be determined if that's the path it takes. So we'll see. Like, that's well, been a personal rule for me, as you well know, Mara. It's not mm -hmm. something written in our fucking club policies. It's an unwritten rule. Um, you yeah, my own. MC. Look, if I have to drop my patch to meet with you, Kelly, I wouldn't even hesitate a second. That's where I'm standing. Oh, okay. We're gonna have to have this talk, Willa. Okay. Uh, didn't realize you were this full and deep. Fuck, my life. I wasn't ready to have this combo with you. Uh, Wolfman and K-pop. I've only got about 20 minutes left, so we need to get this meeting going again. I'm literally stabbing the next person who calls me K-pop. Yeah. Why? Why? Uh, yeah, is I, was, uh, yeah. I don't know. It's fucking gunner. It's a gunner thing. Be down in a couple uh, minutes, okay? Um, all right. All right. Conversation. She is a firecracker. She's probably gonna break your heart. She is a loose fucking cannon, and has a mountain of issues. Probably bigger than Chili out there of issues. However, she is still amazing. You know, kind of like a snow princess. Um, <laughs> I'm never gonna everyone hear that. <laughs> um, if you want to date her, and you two want to be together, you have to understand that Caliber is probably one of the rarest of breeds of people that you ever meet. And if you do anything to break her heart, which is going to be very, very hard because her heart is made of fucking iron, I swear. Um, but it can still be dented. So don't hurt. Because I don't want to break your legs. 
I swear to God, I will never do anything to hurt her. Breaking up with her isn't hurting her. Breaking up with her for an ass or reason, that's hurting her. And that's when you'll get your lips broken. <laughs> Noted. Jesus. Should we get down before the guys start becoming Yeah, before dependent? everybody starts calling you K-pop. Jesus. Yeah, I just want to... My best friend Jesus is done. <laughs> I wasn't expecting to have to have this conversation uh, okay. yet. I thought... Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> Yeah, I thought I was at least gonna have like another. Ow! Ow. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ! All right, we're on our <laughs> way back in. Mara's <laughs> trying to Wait. fucking land on her head. We didn't talk about. It. Yeah, tell her not to die. I didn't Don't come die, up Mara. That way. I didn't. <laughs> if you land it on I the didn't... one place, you're not gonna hurt. <laughs> I didn't know that there was an awning there. <laughs> no one told me. See Willow went and put on the pail. That's... Mm -hmm. She's legitimately fucking amazing. Right. You know, so... We ready? Yeah, let's do this. Send the rest in, President. Alright. Gunner, do you still need me before we go in? Yeah. Alright. I need you before we go in. Alright, I'll be right, right in. We'll you want to get everyone situated tomorrow? Alright. So anything they... anything yeah, I have to say, I can, I can say in front of her. I just would emphasize either way we're going, you're still my president. Yeah. So I don't even suggest, well. because I'm hearing people getting worried about the leadership. That's not happening. Also, no. just, just, we're just, not changing no, the I just VP. want to make that one perfectly clear. We're not changing the VP or the P. Is that is that clear to you, President? Very clear. You're sure? What I don't may mind, change? gentlemen. I am 100% change? I'm, I'm sure. fine with rules changing. I'm fine with... The rank structure changing and everything because there's a new patch, there's a new day, everything is gonna be related to that and it's gonna be mm -hmm. fixed. But, but yeah, I'm not changing the leadership because this is yeah. your club and you need to you need to remain. Yeah. The only thing leader. I ask you as president if it becomes a Viking well, actually independently of what it comes. We need to show more show of force externally, but especially as a Viking, because it's it's the image. What we do here, we can just you know, I, that doesn't matter. But when we roll out, we need to show more show of force. You don't step and, on and the that, Viking. That the Viking one, steps on yeah. you. I mean that Indeed. one. I can uh, that one. I can actually see the point of why they are actually even, even thinking of criticizing us. Because, to be honest, of all of us. As far as I know, I'm the only one who's actually been to jail because I, I stepped up because someone was disrespecting our, our cut, our mm -hmm. patch. And I've been, been arrested. Been in that position many times. Yeah, and I will keep doing that. But I need other people, and that's what I said also. Today, and I emphasize not getting to jail, but if someone is disrespecting our name and our family, I will. Fucking put him down. Right, with, 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 with yes. God, uh, what Ain't I want to say. Nobody gonna question well, that. Yeah. Kelly, so you that's need, more. You need to sell this. Because because what we do, there. Uh, what I said to the rest is that there are currently no other chapters of Vikings. In, no. In San Andreas, so we do whatever the fuck we want with the brand. But out there, we need to be Vikings when we're riding with other crews because they don't. They can't just fucking talk shit about us. And they don't see what happens at the shop. They see what happens out in the fucking street. What is exactly. done out in the fucking street yeah. is always intentional. Exactly. And I don't want this to be no fucking army shit. If he wants to call you K-pop, he can fucking do that. I mean, obviously, if you're fine with that. But 
<laughs> I, I have know, the permission. We still have that thing going on, and when we play pool down at fucking Tequila Law, we're still having fun. And, you know, it's, it's not about that. It's about what we do when we meet the fucking council, or meet anyone else. You know, in yeah. our in our capacity as MC. You need to sell this, Kelly. Great. But but but, Kelly, I'm, people, I right? will not have you to step down. So forget about that. Don't even think about it. Don't bring it up. That's not fucking happening. Then I'll go in and I'll assert that right away. Good. Let's do this. Gotcha. Fuck. I'm going to use the restroom and then I will be right in. Oh, jeez. So go ahead. You girls and your bladder. <sighs> I'm sorry. I had a lot of water, okay? But get everybody ready, get a conversation going, and then shut your fucking mouths when I enter that room. <laughs> I always shut my mouth. Mm-hmm.